Problem 18, we're taking a look at a series as nine terms. And we know a few things. The last term is 18, the fifth term is six. We wanna know what that series is going to be. I did a problem similar to this in problem 10. So if you are curious on a different method, you can go back and watch that one. So you can set this up as a system of equations. But I'm gonna skip that method. I'm gonna do it a little bit differently here. So first of all, if I know that there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine terms, and the last one is 18, the fifth one is six. That means that in this space here, from six to 18, it's going up by 12 by adding the same number, one, two, three, four times. So it's adding the same number four times, and it's going up 12. That means it has to be adding three each time. So six, we have nine, 12, 15, and 18. Working backwards then, I could just keep subtracting all the way over to the first term. Or I could go through and use an equation to solve for it as well. I know that my t of n equation is my first term, which we don't know, plus my common difference that we just solved, times n. Now, when I put 9 in for n, if there's 9 terms, that means it's going to equal my last term, which I now can put in as 18. And I can now solve this for x. So I have 18 equals x plus 3 times 8. So 18 equals x plus 24. So x will equal negative 6. So that's my first term. So my series starts off at six, negative 6, has a common difference of 3, ends with 18, so to write out that series, I'm going to write it as negative 6 plus negative 3 plus 0. I've now established the pattern, plus dot, 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 plus 18. 